Two truths and a lie, but with math. Can you spot the fake? First up, pick any prime number that's not 2 or 3, square it, then subtract 1. You'll always end up with a number divisible by 24. Second, despite the fact that these formulas in 2D and 3D only have pi raised to the first power, formulas in 4 dimensions have pi squared. Lastly, take a balloon and draw a right triangle on it. The Pythagorean theorem will still work despite the edges being warped from the curvature. Now that you've seen all three facts, take a moment to think about which one you think is false. The first one is true. This is because p squared minus 1 can be factored as p minus 1 times p plus 1. Since p minus 1, p, and p plus 1 are three consecutive numbers in a row, one of these has got to be divisible by 3, and that number can't be p since p is prime, so it's got to be one of the other two, meaning that the product of the other two is also divisible by 3. Following similar logic, it's also divisible by 8, meaning it's divisible by 3 times 8, which is 24. The second fact is also true. Here are all the formulas up to 10 dimensions. If you look closely at the powers of pi, they go up by 1 every 2 dimensions, which I have absolutely no idea why. The third fact is fake, because on a sphere, the angles on a triangle don't add up to 180 degrees, so you can have right triangles that are also equilateral triangles, leading to a bunch of contradictions.